welcome to EA Sports live coverage of this cup match. Today it's Barcelona against Juventus. Let's head straight to the Olympia Stadion then. Perfect day for football in Germany. Not too hot. The sun beating down though from a cloudless sky. Your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. What we've been waiting for, the final tremendous scenes in the stadium. Absolutely packed. Yeah, I think you could argue, Martin, there's some justification. The best two teams in this tournament have got themselves into the final, expecting a good game. Barcelona's lineup here. Marc Andre Testegan starts in goal. Dani Alves starts with Jordi Alba as the fullbacks. Iniesta plays with Xavi in the centre of the park. Luis Suarez is the lone striker today. Juventus lineup then. Gigi Buffon plays in goal. Andrea Basali starts with Giorgio Chiellini as the centre backs. Claudio Marchisio plays with Arturo Vidal in the centre of the park. In attack, Fernando Llorente plays up front with Carlos Tevez. Well, for Juventus, the uh, great thrill of being champions again. The old lady holding up the trophy. Yeah, and uh, good to see, isn't it? And back in what they would regard as their own ground after. An unhappy spell at Stadio Delle Alpi, which they never liked, and uh, are looking upwards now rather than down. The long talk is over, now the game is underway, and Barcelona have started it. Hello. Arturo Vida. Fernando Llorente. Tevez. Paul Pogba. Trying to find Tevez. It's Messi. Neymar. He was the poster boy for Brazil in the World Cup of 2014. His dream didn't quite come true. But there's time on his side, and he's an exceptional player. Shots on here. Goalkeeper not needed because they've stopped the shot. Fernando Llorente. Neymar. Made the challenge well. Iniesta. Andres Iniesta, who had the honour of scoring the winning goal. Here's a shot. Brave defending by the player. Juventus will get the throw. Daniel Alves. Tries his luck. Very good try here. Skimming past the post. Pogba, and he gets it back again, quickly. Pirlo, playing it. And attacking now Juventus. Passed his man there. Fernando Llorente. Pogba! I think it's really hard, it's probably the hardest part of officiating to get these offside calls right. They do it much more often than not, don't they? Yeah, you do have to take a chance when you play that kind of game. Neymar. He's controlling the play here. His teammates just borrow the ball for a few moments and then give it back to the main man. Into the face of the opposition. Here's the shot. Goal! Off the post and in! in off the post goalkeeper absolutely beaten oh, it's a wonderful strike really just effort another angle on it here <laughs> good news for Barcelona they lead Fernando 
Llorente. Well, they're in a good position here. Fernando Llorente. Pirlo. Papa! My word! How close was that to an equaliser? Messi. That's a good chance now to cross. Iniesta. Oh, Basel have got to be. He's gone for goal. Well, the referee has signaled for half time, and it's 1 0 here. Big game. With big pressures on the players, but they've responded well, haven't they? They're in front at half time. Yeah. The danger, as always, when you are so close to glory, is that uh, you get a little nervous. They've got to avoid that in the second half. Right, we're ready to go for the start of the second half, and Juventus to kick off. Lichsteiner. Fernando Llorente. Vida. Llorente. We'll get it back here. Marquisio. Paul Pogba. Jordi Alba. Jordi Alba. Luis Suarez. That's comfortable for Buffon. Llorente. Paul Pogba. It's with Tevez. Fernando Llorente. And he shoots. Well hit hard, but straight at the goalkeeper. Juventus, I think feeling a bit desperate here. Well, I think we're going to see some, some Route 1 stuff here, Martin, in the next few minutes. Might not be pretty, but I'll be hoping it'll be effective. Andrea Pirlo. Good save by the goalkeeper, and he makes sure he keeps the ball. It's been a thrilling game here, and there's still plenty in it as we go into the last few minutes. Scores very close. Chance for it. Got to be. And that's a brilliant goal. Well taken. The ball for Messi. And that's wonderful. Wonderful technique to just feather it into the bottom right. Different angle on it here. it back from his teammate and there it is it's come back here's the chance just as well someone got in the way of that i wonder whether the goalkeeper can get his head to this corner play for Barcelona three minutes that's all that's left now Lionel Messi goes for goal and it's in the net and it's Barcelona who scored the goal for Messi and he had a bit of time to make up his mind here and he decided to place it and hasn't he placed it beautifully into the left corner good look here again by the replay of the goal
pulled away. And that big lead now is surely something that they'll see through in this match. Time ticking away. He's being challenged now. Lichsteiner. Pereira. Arturo Vida. Here he is with the chance. He goes for goal. And he's missed it. And now Iniesta. Well, that's the moment they've been waiting for, the final whistle. And the joy of knowing the trophy is theirs. Yeah, they've all stuck together in this competition, and they did over the course of that 90 minutes we've just seen. That team spirit has taken them a long way, hasn't it? Well, there's an old expression, being up for the cup. This team have certainly been up for this challenge, and they're going to lift up the cup very shortly. So, up they step for the souvenirs. Small trinkets, really, but they mean so much. Well, there's only so many trophies on offer during the course of the season. And that's why it does mean so much for any footballer to be in this position, to, to be on that podium. Wonderful stuff. It's such a fantastic feeling to win any football match, but to win one when there's major silverware at stake uh, almost defies description. I think they'd be delighted as well, Martin. In fact, they played well over the course of the final, that 90 minutes when they really did have to show what they've got. They responded to the challenge, and that makes it all the more satisfying. Well, it's quite a scene here. Suddenly, having looked tired towards the end of the game, they found remarkable energy. Yeah, they'll keep going all night now, I'm sure of that. The adrenaline will be pumping.